Father's Day, everyone. Uh, I just wanted to make this quick video uh, going over my backyard 3D course. In a lot of my shooting videos, I don't say what yardage I'm shooting at. Uh, this might give you some help, especially some of my older videos, which I'm not going to go back and edit or anything. Um, this white pin is my 20 yard marker. I typically shoot from this white pin and this like gravel pit. I'm usually between the gravel pit and the white pit. That's pretty much like where I'm shooting from. Typically, I start out shooting from here. Um, I have a pin set up at 10, which is the red here that the kids shoot from sometimes. I used to shoot from a while ago and my target cam is set up on the five yard pit. And these are all measured from roughly this rock. So everything is based off of like pretty much where the rock is, like the back end of the imp. So the deer is a little further than 20, the imp's a little closer than 20, but I'm never actually shooting from the 20 yard pin typically. So if you look back, you walk back, there's the five yard pin, that's where the target cam is. There's 10 yard pins just used as a marker. I don't really use, do it for, use, like, use for anything anymore. I used to have a 15 yard pin, but I don't shoot from 15 anymore. Um, here's the 20. The, this right here is the 25 yard marker. It, 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 it worked out perfectly. This is 25 yards. And sometimes I do shoot from within the gravel pit. So I'll take 25 yard shots from here a lot of times. So. After 25, you have to walk around. And then there's an incline right here to the side of the house. And this rock is the 30 yard marker. So you see the gravel pits right here? That's the 25 yard, that edge. Then this rock is the 30 yard marker. And I take my 30 yard shots from here. You can see the view. It's very, well, the camera's actually set back behind the 30 yard. I'm standing at the 30 yard and the camera is roughly at the 33 yard, 35 yard marker. And this is the view you see. All my shots that are taken from 30 yards are from up here. Um, and then I have my 35 yard marker, which is that rock right here. And then you see this pin here is my 40 yard marker. I typically don't film from back here. I do shoot from back here, but filming's tough because it's hard to actually get the targets on in, in the shot. Um, I just need a better setup where I can actually bring the target, like the camera up higher. But I just don't have the setup right here because after this, it's like the front of the house and the driveway. So that's it. I just wanted to give you a quick rundown on my 3D course. Um, if you'll bear with me for another minute, I'll take you back to the downhill course that I've just been working on and still finalizing, but behind the house, the uh, property just goes down into like an unusable, it's, well, yeah, it's like where I dump all the leaves. So this is like the, the back downhill course where I have like the three little DIY targets. Actually, there's four. There's a fourth one here. And these are all roughly, I think that back target is like 20 yards back, five, 10 feet down or so. So it comes out to almost like 25, a 25 yard shot or so. Um, and that's right next to right here. So I'm shooting basically from these targets, this line, back down into the hill. And that's it. Hope you all have a happy Father's Day. Stay tuned.